Alrighty ho neighbors, this is Max Stevens. I buy old records, me and old Jesse Lee, that guy. We are gonna go out and do a little looking, but I gotta go by the post office, then the UPS store, drop off a package. And uh, then I think we're, it's cold. It's cold as balls here, if that's a quantifiable unit of measurement. Uh, so we're going to go looking probably for Ann Richardson, Plano maybe, not too far off. If it's kind of icy on the bridges, I'll probably come back. I don't want to mess up my car or my day or somebody else's day for that matter. Ha, thinking about other people, isn't that weird? So let's go on, see what we can find. Yada, yada, yada. Maybe I've got a handful of good records today. Maybe I'll come back with the whole Honda Element full. Doubt it. Let's go looking. Well, this place is a red chateau. We're going to check it out and see. This looks a little too frou frou for me, me, but I have bought good records in this place. Looks like they've got, ooh, 78s right over here. I'll be over here, Jess. I found some 78s. Amazing, some of these records are 100 years old, or close to it anyway. Ooh, look at that sleeve. Erase? No. Looking for this, so Vocalion race sleeves. Sometimes even the hillbilly sleeves are great. Nice shape, a lot of these. Oh, nothing in this stack. Well, I haven't found anything else so far. Load 16 tons of records and what do you get? Alright, we got some records to look at. All right, a little bit of country, a lot of pop. Well, right time frame, just nothing I have to have. That's encouraging though. Oh, wow. $12,000. That's the great Pebble Christ picture. Done, I think, sometime in the early 2000s, more than likely. Back in the golden age of do-it-yourself pebble religious art. Ooh, lots of 45s. Coolness. $25. Are you kidding me? I don't think they're kidding me. $35 firm for that recent reissue. What a bargain, huh? Hmm, maybe not. Old Frankie. We got here, we got. I gotta check that one out. was here. Eh, being Crosby and such, so I'm not worried. Well, I'm going to get this. It looks mint shape. Buck seventy-five. It's that $20 record. If I can turn the, that into $20, that's a good thing. Well, alright. We're going to go over to another antique mall that's got a big slug of records in it. 
we're just out because it's been cold we've been kind of stuck in the house for days okay we've reached next place there's a big stall in here full of records and i found some good stuff here before sometimes i've gone out with what the little bird left on the limb essentially but let's hope for the best today i'll check this stall and then we'll go to the rest of the area i think this is it hmm is it gone oh man i hope not what oh no here it is good yeah we got 78s here and i'm gonna take a look rock and stroll okay we've got some interesting looking stuff I think I might look that one up. I don't think it's anything, Do Ray Sisters, but I don't know. Maybe my mind is failing me again. So here we go. Good Jerry Lee Lewis. Teenage Letter by Jerry Lee. It's in nice shape. About VG plus almost. But see, Teenage Letter will bring usually about $15 or so, so I might as well buy it. I don't have any extra copies at the house. Uh, a little too rough for the price. Hey, look here. Uh, they're useless. They're not good for anything. Make sure witchcraft isn't a stereo version. Nah. Was looking for those odd versions of Elvis's RCA stuff. Although it's harder and harder to move. Jimmy Don Lee saw that last week somewhere. Mm, no. What is it? Hmm, way back in the country. Old Shiner. You know something? No. Got a guy that might buy stuff like that, but at a dollar. So if I spend a dollar or eight to make it to get back a dollar, well, that don't do me any good, does it? Bill Haley. I can't really do anything with him unless it's on holiday or maybe one of the SX promo, SX promo type things. Whoop. Little Bond Saw. Eh, no. I was looking for Nathan Abshire or that other guy that did some good uh, rocking stuff. Mary Travis, no. What is that? Chuck's monster. I have to look that up. Could be a Halloween record. Those usually will sell. Even though Halloween records are some of the worst things ever committed to uh, record by humans. Oh, picking this stroll. I see that. That is one that uh, you don't ever see here in Texas anyway. It never turns up. Huh. Boo hoo hoo sachets. $12? No. Mm -mm. I don't think so. All right, somebody tried to pull the label off too. That's not good. Even if it is high price and you want it, you don't go pulling labels off. 
You go talk him down or wait till it goes down in price. You don't go pulling labels. I think I already saw this stack today. Yeah. Okay, I forgot to turn my camera on, but I'm finding a lot of four star label stuff. Here's one of them damn out of records. Another one. Claude Ham. The Western Rambler. Recitations, we don't want that. If you see recitation on the album, run. aren't so well known but they bring really good money. Paul Page. Fenton oh no, no square dance. Pine tops will be really you just like to tell you. Yeah. Big old pressing pimple, that's gonna pop or skip. Ah, oh, okay, we're gonna finish this out. We kinda need to get home. Today wasn't a full work day or anything. So, we're just looking a little bit as we're heading towards the door. Found a couple, found that Virtues Boogie Woogie, which is a great instrumental, Jerry Lee Lewis. And yeah, it's five, but I can flip it for 10 or 15. Might as well just take the free money. So today wasn't much of a wow wow day, but I'm just glad to get out and look. Maybe you saw something there, maybe you saw something there that I should have picked up and you're freaking out. That's okay. It's good for your heart right to get that, get that freak out energy going. So anyway, didn't find much today. Maybe I'll stop at another place if I see one open or something, you know. Big city antique malls and such like that. They're sometimes good. Usually, though, they don't get replenished enough to really make it worth your while. Unless you get bored like I did today. And you just want to go out and keep your shuffling game go going by shuffling some vinyl. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. So, uh, anyhow, we're going to work our way back. So, maybe this is goodbye for now. Maybe I'll be back in a little bit looking at records. Talking about today, not forever. That'll be later. Eh, maybe not.